Hi guys! Okay, I'm coming at you with this video later than I planned, but it's been a busy week. However, it is Halloween day, and in case you're curious about vegan candies, whether you're sifting through your kids' bags, or you're going to run to the store to buy something and you want to buy vegan candies, here is a list from PETA, and I also have um, something from Veg News as well. I've gone through a few sites to sort of glean some of the popular vegan candies that are out there. So the first one, uh, Airheads. That's pretty cool. Those are cool little treats, and uh, they're tasty. My, my daughter likes those, and they're vegan. Now, uh, Bottle Caps by Wonka, vegan. Chicka Sticks. I've never, okay, what, crunchy peanut butter and toasted coconut candy. I've never had those. Those are also vegan. Cry Babies, extra sour bubble gum, vegan. Don't you love that face right there? And Dots, vegan. Assorted fruit flavored gumdrops by Tootsie. Dum Dums, these are also vegan. And just to look here, here's the website for Dum Dums. And those, uh, you know, you can get a big, bag of these candies give out a lot and those are vegan they've got lemon lime dum-dums and other flavors as you can see all right let me get back to the um the pita page okay so dum-dums are vegan fireballs now i was excited to see this on the list because i remember loving fireballs when i was young haven't had them in a while but uh, still cool to know that they're vegan now brax cinnamon hard candy also vegan guys it looks like they're individually wrapped as well, so if you want to give those out, that's an idea. Fun Dip. Who knew? Also by Wonka. Love it. So this is vegan. That's a nice treat. My daughter loves that as well. Uh, Hubba Bubba Bubblegum. Vegan. Perfect. Jolly Ranchers. Now, I was really happy about this because Jolly Ranchers, this is a very popular candy company. They have lollipops and hard candy, and they're vegan. Brax Lemon Drops vegan. Cocomels. Now this is coconut milk caramels. Looks delicious. I've never tried it. I now have to go on the hunt to find some because they look delicious, guys. Okay, so Surf's Sweets Fruity Bears, also vegan. And notice they're, they're perfect. It says here, great for trick-or-treaters, 20 treat packs. So uh, all ready to go, just if you can find them, pop one in a bag for your trick-or-treaters at your door. Now, Pixie Sticks by Wonka as well. You know, those are the uh, like the candy-filled straws with that candy powder, grape, cherry, orange, Maui Punch. My daughter loves those as well. Vegan. Now, what is this? Juji Fruits. Okay, so these are chewy, fruity candy. Oh, yeah, like a gummy kind of candy. Also vegan. Awesome. And Charms Blow Pops. Those are vegan as well, guys. I think I had a site for them somewhere else, but I'll get to that. Now, Smarties. Not the kind of Smarties with chocolate in the middle, but you'll know what these are if you've ever trick-or-treated in your life. These are those little colored, sort of chalk-like candies that I always found to be addictive. I loved these. They sell these en masse anywhere you're looking to buy Halloween candy. Those are vegan. Love it. So I don't have to feel guilty about going out and buying some to munch on because I do like those. Sour Patch Kids, they've got they these gummy, they look sort of like gummy candies, okay, but these are vegan as well. And again, Wonka, kudos to Wonka, lots of vegan treats. Spooky Nerds, orange and white punch flavors, vegan, right here guys. And Wonka again, with their everlasting gobstopper, jawbreakers jaw that change colors and flavors, pretty cool sounding, haven't tried those, maybe I will now. Swedish Fish, soft and chewy candy, vegan, it's fat-free as well. And again, Wonka, totally a leader here in uh, not using any sort of animal products for their treats, but they have something called Sweet Tarts. Now here's also candies now and later. I've never had this that I can think of, maybe a long time ago, also vegan. And Zots. Where the fizz is. Yeah, that must be those lovely candies that pop in your mouth. I used to love those as well. Those are also vegan. Now, notably not on this list, which is a surprise to me, and you might be excited about this, is Skittles. Skittles Original are vegan. 
Now this is this website here is vegnews.com, so look them up and look up Halloween candy and you'll find it. They've got a very extensive list. You can also see they've got Twizzlers on here, Dandy's Marshmallows, though I wouldn't expect, unless they have little packs, you wouldn't be giving out a single marshmallow. But Cracker Jacks are vegan, and of course they've got some of the same things, but they've got other things listed as well. This is, I'm not sure, Enjoy Life. Um, some kind of looks like, like chocolate, maybe caramel. Uh, um, I'm going to go through the list a little bit here. Ooh, what's this? Peanut butter, Justin's Peanut Butter Cups. But the big thing on this list is the Skittles, Twizzlers, Cracker Jacks. And if you go to this website, you'll see they show you, for example, the Airheads, which we spoke about, I mentioned before. It tells you the flavors, what's vegan. But it does appear that all the flavors are vegan from the other site we were at. It also shows you here other companies that offer vegan treats, Allison's Gourmet, Apple Fudge, Apple Pie Fudge, Artisan Vegan Caramels, now, some of this you won't be putting in a bag for trick-or-treaters. Oh, look at it. It looks so good. But if you're buying for yourself, because why can't you treat yourself for uh, Halloween? Why not? Okay, um, let me just take a look to see Vegan Fudge. Mmm, looks so good, guys. I think I might have to order from this site. Vegan Chocolates. Yum, yum. Uh, vegan Brownies. Again, not what you'd particularly be buying for trick-or-treaters, but um, for yourself, why not? Okay, so Alter Eco. Now this I found interesting because they sell chocolate bars, and so their dark chocolate is vegan. And I'm just going to show you the, the page. I might have this up somewhere. No, I don't. See? Sea salt truffles. Now I have to get that because, you know the, um, oh gosh, Lindor chocolates that come like this? My daughter really likes those, and... Now it's nice to know they have something else. I'm going to have to order some of these. So this is good for me, too, to find this information. All right. Let me go back to uh, the Veg News site. So Amy E's Bakery Caramel Cashew Bar. Let's just take a look at that quickly. Oh, that says page not found. Okay, fine. Um, oh, here's the Chicka Sticks. Crunchy Peanut Butter Bars. Brax, it shows you the various candies, but I've gone through that. Charm Blow Pops, all the flavors. Um, the Chicago Vegan Foods with the, the marshmallows. And I heard they have a pumpkin-flavored marshmallow in time for Halloween, but um, again, that's just a treat more for yourself as opposed to probably giving out at the door. And here, I'm not going to go through all of this, guys, because it's a long list, but I will show you this page this is the endangered species chocolates. And look, you've got your dark chocolate with pumpkin spice and almonds, dark chocolate with cranberries, dark chocolate with peppermint crunch, dark chocolate with cacao nibs, which are chocolate, so anyway. And then they've got the little bites. So now this is milk chocolate, but if you want vegan, this is dark chocolate. So this might be something as well that you could pass out at the door. See, little dark chocolate pouches. Again, could be expensive, but this website right here, chocolatebar.com, has a whole host of vegan products, guys. And again, not just for Halloween, but you can indulge for yourself. Okay, well, that's all for me for now. So vegnews.com, Vegan Candy, and PETA are both resources that will help you in your vegan sifting through your kid's bag or last-minute vegan Halloween buying frenzy. Or if you watch this next year, it will give you a heads-up on the products you can buy to give out for Halloween if you want to give out vegan candy. All right. Thanks for watching, guys.